gentle. <laughs> I think I wrote this about love. I'm dissembled and distraught. My love reaches out for yours in a desert void of all light and darkness. A black hole in a place that was once an ocean. The earth is exposed and cracked like what I imagine Earth's Mars must feel like. Even the dirt seems thirsty. Right. <laughs> even the dirt seems thirsty and dark and abandoned by warmth and cold alike as even they wish to nothing to do with this place. My heart beats heavy with the burden of unconditional love and yet it's empty. Wishing the best for you whilst confronting the onslaught of emotions that attaches to such duality is a par for the course when you play the game of love like a true gentleman. And so I stomp through these puddles, left by the deluge of my destructive emotions. My feet follow this path, muddied by the storm, until they bring me to the present. Life is the present, and it's my choice to unwrap the smile therein. I believe in each and every one of you. There is no problem with a little mud on the path as long as we take off our shoes before we enter the temple. I study myself in the mirror. Looking into myself to see what is left, I see myself, which is all I should ever need. My hair is wet, and it sticks to my face. I can hardly recognize the man standing back at, staring back at me, but he is clearly my friend. He's a little older wow. and wiser, with a heavier heart and honored to to have a greater definition of love and the practice thereof. I love deeply and truly and honestly and wholly and undeterred and unfettered and although I am confused, I am also emboldened and strong and I stand tall and carry myself through these feelings without running and without fear of judgment. I love and I am proud to love. I cry and I am proud to cry. Love is great and love feels great and love feels horrible and love is incredible and real and true. I have courage and hope and compassion and patience. I have my health and my emotions and my intelligence and I have love and I have me and my experience of love and my life as seen through my love. In the understanding of love, the meaning is lost. Just be love and be loved. Embrace life. Love you and yourself and share your ex experience of love through your actions as a whole and not just their explanations. Conceptualize love and change your life through the experience of love's greatest meaning. Love is old and love is new, and she is blind and disheveled. She is distraught. Experience love's greatest meaning. Love is raw and untamed like the mane of the almighty lion. Love is you and love is me and love is the earth and the trees and the wind and the seas. Love is all there is and all that should ever matter. We live, we love, and then we release. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Keep those hands going from Max, ladies and gentlemen, Max. And you can go visit him.